Okay, so in this video we're going to look at how you can cheat at referencing. Well, kind of. We can look at how to make referencing a bit easier for you. So if you're anything like me, at the end of the paper you've got lists of journal articles and books that you've used but you haven't referenced yet. Now there are ways of making this easier. If you have the journal article title, you can search for that in the library catalogue. So put in the full title in the search box, hit search. As we've searched for it through VU, we'll get a reference, which should come up the first one of the first couple of things there. Now on the right side of the screen, you can see where I've circled it, you can click on the folder and you can add it to your saved items. It should make a little flash at the bottom of the screen and your saved items folder will increase by one. So you can see that there. Once you've saved your item, you can click on the saved items folder, which will bring up this window here. You can see the list of referencing styles available, so click the one you need. In our case here, we'll need APA. Then you can just copy and paste that into your paper and the reference is done. If you're not ready to do that, you can email it to yourself. And if you know about other referencing software, you can import, export it to that. So once you've done that, you just need to repeat this process for each reference you have. So this will work for all your library-based items, so your books and your journals that you got through the database or the catalogue, and any AV materials you might have found through the catalogue. Sadly, though, this won't work for web pages. All right, so here's a list I've prepared earlier of about six different things that we've used for the paper. So you can see they're all in proper APA style, but they're not in alphabetical order, and in some cases for the journal articles, it's missing bits of information. So you need to go through it. It's not a complete or perfect referencing system, but it'll make life a lot easier for you. All right, so that is how you kind of cheat at referencing. Good luck. Okay, so here we're going to do a finding the um, item and referencing it live. So we're looking for the item critical care and transport. Hit search. And there's our book there, critical care transport. We go and add it to our saved items list on the right here. Click, open up the folder. There's one I prepared earlier. Click on APA. Now we have our reference. You can see it's not in alphabetical order, so you still have a little bit of work to do. All right, good luck.